time lapse with your DSLR camera. Hello, my name is Doug Hubble and welcome to Astrophotography Tutorials. Today I'm going to talk about time lapse photography with your DSLR camera. Now, when I started to look into this, I found that uh, people were using an uh, intervalometer, an external device that would plug in, and it does actually plug into your camera, and it will work. But the thing is, is I discovered something a little bit better. I discovered something called <laughs> Magic Lantern. The camera that I have right now is a Canon T2i, and the Magic Lantern software will fit on a whole variety of different Canon cameras so you can uh, probably have work on your Canon camera as well. Now what I'm going to do is I'm going to try to do some uh, night photography as well and with the intervalometer inside of the Magic Lantern what I can do is I can take longer exposures and be able to get maybe some stars in the night. One of the challenges at night when you're trying to focus is you won't be able to focus because it's so dark and what I'm going to do to, during the day is I'm going to go ahead and set the focus on a distant object during the day and then I'm going to lock the focus because when you do shots at night you want to just use your manual focus so I'm going to try this I'm going to go ahead focus on on some of those clouds up there the focus is now locked now what I'm going to do is I'm going to take some of this painters tape and I'm just going to just kind of lightly put that on there to hold the focus wrapped it around here and the painters tape if you've ever used this before it, it isn't really uh, has a lot of adhesive on it where it's going to leave Mars on your equipment so that's why I chose to use this painter tape now what I can do at this point right it's on autofocus I did that so I could focus on a distant point but now I'm going to take this autofocus and turn it to manual focus Keep the tripod a little bit uh, steady I've got a bottle of water in there time-lapse intervalometer with magic lantern you press the little trash can icon down here and this will bring up the the different menus uh, you can uh, go back and forth with the arrow keys we want to go to the shoot menu here now sometimes what will happen is is the intervalometer, I don't know, on mine sometimes doesn't show up there, but if I press the menu button right here, it'll show it. The bulb timer I don't want on. Take that off. Turn the intervalometer on. You can press the uh, the Q button right here and let's say take a picture every how many ever seconds you want to make that. You can go up or down on this going left or right and it'll change the values there. I'm doing one right now for 35 seconds. Exit out with taking the uh, Q button again. Now it says it's going to take one every 35 seconds and now it should just go ahead and start taking pictures. I have it set on auto with no flash. Stay tuned for the next video where I will show you the settings for nighttime photography to take time-lapse videos. Also, if this is your first time watching, I would like you to subscribe. I publish two astrophotography videos on the 1st and 15th of every month. Thanks for watching, and I hope to see you soon.